Ba-ding! Hey everyone, my name is Marcus Stewart, and welcome to day 12 of 30 Days of Backlog, and it's morphin' time! That would be a morpher there, imagine it. Because, taking a look at Power Rangers, Battle for the Grid, and yeah, and I'm wearing, I'm dressed for the occasion, I have a black shirt, because the, the Black Ranger was always my favorite as a kid, and as a Power Rangers rule, you have to wear the shirt, or you have to wear the color, of your ranger because that's that's how you know what ranger you are otherwise like the characters wouldn't know who was who like if tommy wasn't wearing green stuff all the time they'd be like who is this guy is he pink yellow we don't know so yeah just letting you know representing the black ranger and uh look at this we got just my childhood on screen at least for the most part we got lord zed got the white ranger i don't know who those two dudes in the middle are um that's like that's after my time um it's like goldar way in the back there but yeah this is the Power Rangers fighting game that came out, God, was it last year? I think it was last year? That I have heard is better than some might expect. I remember hearing about it when it was coming out and pretty much didn't really pay any attention to it. I was like, eh, I don't know if this will be anything worth looking at. Um, but it's got, a, a, from what I understand, a pretty dedicated little community around it. So we're going to check it out today. Is that Black Panther? Like, in the middle, that just looks like Black Panther on steroids. Um, we're checking the online service, apparently. Loading DLC. All right, here we are. All right, so there's a story mode. Oh, are there cutscenes? Look at that's Kimberly. Oh, she's cr oh she's, holding, she's holding the Green Ranger's helmet. Is that from the, um, the Green Ranger saga? Oh, look at that. Goldar there. Arcade versus training so pretty standard oh i like that art who's that other pink ch is that kimberly again did she come back because i know like tommy came back a bunch of times on like the later power ranger stuff did she come back too as like super pink ranger so i probably should get into my history with power rangers before we get into this so i showing my age again i guess i grew up with power rangers I watched, you know, Mighty Morphin when it first debuted, and I watched for quite a while. I, I watched every season of Power Rangers up to Time Force. Like, Time Force was the last season I watched in its entirety, and then after that, I didn't see anything. So, I think the season after Time Force was, like, Wild, Wild Force, the animal one. Didn't see that, so Time Force was my last one. So, I do recognize the Time Force Pink Ranger there in the back. Um, so, you know, I saw, like, Zeo... Lightspeed Rescue, Galaxy, um, Space, which is the best season, Space, um, you know, every, uh, Turbo. So, you know, I, 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 I've, I've spent some years as a Power Rangers fan. Um, so this is kind of, this is cool as if nothing else is a nostalgia trip. I don't know who that cool looking Green Ranger down there is, like a Green Ranger, White Ranger thing. I think I've, I've heard of him, I think. Is that Tommy too? Isn't he like Lord something? I, I, I remember having friends tell me about that guy. Um, but let's, uh, jump into story, I guess. Um, okay, chapter one. Act one, six acts in a chapter. So I wonder how long this is. Um, I wonder if they can do the Nether Realm, like, Mortal Kombat fighting story. Like, that style of fighting game story. Zordon is gone. The Rangers and their last stand have been crushed. That's Rita's voice. Taking the white light for yourself. Is that the actual Rita Repulsa voice actress? Because it sounds pretty similar. Lord Draken, that's right. That was the name. Thank you, Empress. So wait, Rita came back in like the show, or is that just for the game? You don't seem pleased. I've had a lot on my mind. Tell me, child. What troubles you? Zordon chose children for a reason. I mean teenagers, technically, not children. But also teenagers with attitude. I thought that's why he really wanted them for their attitude. Eventually, though, every child realizes the truth that their parents, for all their strengths, are incredibly flawed. That they have feet of clay. That in many ways they hold us back. Eventually, every child realizes. I think, I think that guy's a member of Soldier. Lies. Oh! He stabbed Rita! That's the most violent thing I've ever seen in Power Rangers. 
it's only fitting that they be your end. Rest now. The time is done. I will continue what we have started. Huh. So again, Power Rangers fans, because I know there's a, a big community of like people that still keep up with Power Rangers, like adults that read the comics and stuff. Was all of that made up, or is that just like like made up for the game, or is that all canon stuff that happened in like the later shows or the comics? Like, does Rita Repulsa come back? Is that supposed to be Tommy? It looks like Tommy. It didn't really sound like Tommy, or at least maybe Tommy being your series. And if it is Tommy, is it Jason David Frank, the, the actor? I think that's his name. Um, I have so many questions. Uh, Kimberly, there she is. So what's the word, Jason? Are we going again? Or are you calling it quits? Jason, oh, we're calling them by their full names. If you've got the time, I'm trying to remember how their voices sound. To beat you? Always. That's my Kimberly. Heh. <laughs> and here I thought this was light combat. More for time. Back to action. <laughs> <laughs> you know what they say. Too much big power is dangerous. Did they get the, the voice cast back to do this? Like the original actors? Okay, I'm Red Ranger. Okay. My kicks. There we go. Got a super wizard down there. Eh. Eh. Okay, let's see. Kind of... Doesn't play bad, I guess. It's kind of... Competent so far, you know, early impressions. Oh, a little combo there. What is what is that? Do I have a move list? Oh, there we go. Tyranno upper. Titanus counter. Back roll. Triple slice. Tyranno charge. That's a super move. Okay. Right, let's see what we can do. I got a super move. Is that my Tyro Tyranno charge? Let's see what my grab does. Okay. Whatever. Oh! There we go. Mega! Look at Zordon back there. He looks... Kinda creepy? I don't know why. He doesn't look... I don't know why. Maybe it's because he's like in higher definition than like in the original show. But he like looks kind of weird. Like he just looks like an actual head. Which I mean it should look like an actual head. But like you said. Maybe it's a little too well defined. And it's a little just more terrifying. Than kind of a ghostly looking head. That's just the that's just the dude. Who played Zordon? I don't think I ever knew who like the actor for Zordon was. Like. Like no. Alright. Are we in round two? Or is it still? Oh she's got all her meters. So I better watch. Let's see, is it Street Fighter block or is it Mortal Kombat block? I think it's Street Fighter block where you hold black, uh, hold the back button to block. Oh, what did I just? I'm trying to see. I don't think Hadouken does anything. Doesn't seem right. I don't know what that does. That like blue thing. Yeah, does that like give me strength? Is it like Jade from Mortal Kombat where projectiles will just fly through me for a short period? Where's Alpha? Why isn't he in the stage in the background? I did it. Really? You started without me? Usa Ia! That's Tommy. That's the only thing. <laughs> the thing that always stood out to me about Tommy. Whenever he fought, he always did the scene like, Usa Ia! He's like the only guy that grunted like that. You're supposed to be here like an hour ago. Australian doubles, you two against me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You think I need Tommy to be- I mean, you did just kind of lose to me. Her helmet looks weird. Like, Kimberly's helmet, it looks off. Like, it looks too big, the eyes or something. It looks kind of dopey. <laughs> so it's like that, huh? I, uh, you know, standing right here. Alright, do I get to be- Do I get to be Tommy? Hey, the action! Yeah! Green Ranger. So, um, if you're around my age and you're a kid when the original Mighty Morphin Power Rangers is on, one of the highlights of my childhood, and possibly yours, was the Green Ranger saga. When the Green Ranger was first introduced and he's evil, he was the evil Six Ranger that was like beating the crap out of all the other Power Rangers, and you're like, oh man, that cool Tommy guy that just, you know, 
transfer to Angel Grove or wherever he came from. He seems pretty awesome, but you're like, oh no, he's evil. And you're like, man, he's sh he's green. He's got a shield. He has body armor. Even though, like for like that's better than the the regular Rangers. He's got a uh, basically Godzilla as a mech. Like Mecha Godzilla is pretty much a Zord. And that whole saga, like that was the first time probably I can remember as a kid where I was like emotionally invested in a television show like to like to my emotional core where like I was literally just hanging on every word every episode of like what's Tommy gonna do is Tommy gonna kill all of them how can he do this like the the one scene that sticks with me or one like part of that saga was when the Red Ranger gets trapped in the really foggy room with Goldar and he doesn't have his morpher like it's on the ground but he can't find it because it's covered in fog and it's like this big empty room with Goldar the big golden ape guy and the only he can't fight Goldar without the the morpher because Goldar is like one of the the strongest bad guys. So he has to like hide in the fog, and the fog's so thick that Goldar can't see him. And he's also kind of toying with the Red Ranger, so he keeps stabbing the ground with his sword trying to find him. And the Red Ranger's like rolling around on the ground trying to like hide. And you're like the whole time I'm like holding my breath, praying that the Red Ranger doesn't get caught, and he's trying to find his morpher. And the whole time Goldar is just like talking shit like well i'm gonna find you i'm gonna find you you're nothing and i just remember like being so stressed out as a kid watching that that whole scene every time they went back to it i'm like oh god oh god god what a what a time to be alive power rangers i mean i guess it's still a time to be alive because power Rangers still comes on give up same time tomorrow i'll be there talk you in some 101 Whoa, you want me to stay for extra? You need to make it, oh, uh-oh. Uh what does that mean? Because they did, those two were dating, right? Sounds like, oh, no, Tommy, don't, oh. Yeah, Tommy's not a big movie guy, nice. I wonder if he can summon Zords. Like, if, like I feel like that should be like the, the super special, like Zord shows up and like, Stomps in your opponent. Alright, more of this. Yeah. So we're gonna play some arcade story. And then uh, after that, we're gonna go on lines. I wanna see what the, the the real players, the people that really like this game, I wanna see what like what top level play looks like. So uh, stay tuned for that uh, a little bit later in the video. Oh, nice. That was almost like a Street Fighter kind of combo there. Um, eh. Alright. Let me look at my move list real quick. Can I... Dragon Wave, Dragon Drop, Dragon Drill, Dragon Dragon, Super Dragon, Ultimo Dragon. Um, hmm. Okay. That's my dr is that my Dragon Drop, Dragon Kick? Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, you're not dead. Oh, yeah. You have, everyone has multiple health bars. So it's kind of like an injustice, it seems like. This is, like just the multiple health bar thing. Wait, what happened? Oh, oh, okay. I thought, the, honestly, I thought it was my TV. I was like, is the HDMI acting up? What's going on? Ay, 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 ay. It's a dimensional energy spike. It's shooting out. Oh, Alpha. The most useless character on the show. I mean, he had his moments, but he's pretty, you know, he's comic relief. He's, he's, he's basically Snarf from Thundercats. Like, the same amount of usefulness. Let's see, no one can get in without a power coin. Oh, okay, so Lord Dracon is not Tommy? So he's a different person. He looks like Tommy, he's like a clone of Tommy? Who are you supposed to be? Oh, Tommy, so naive, I am your destroyer. Lord Dr oh, oh, okay. Maybe it is. He says, Tommy sounds just like you. You know what? I take back my question. I don't care who you are. Why you're here, uh, that almost became a Backstreet Boys song for a second. Knock off Zax? Yeah, where is... Where is Zax? I want to play as Zax. The Black Ranger is the coolest character. Everybody knows that. Like, he's the cool guy. He does dance fighting. He's got all the smoothest lines. Best dresser. Wait, what? What the? What is this? Why are there... Wait. There are Stormtrooper Black Rangers? What is this? 
Again, is this, a, is, this, is this something that was made up for the game, or is this a real thing that happens in Power Rangers? I mean, this isn't happening. Not in mo Whoa, what is that? Okay. Okay, they're like little... Okay, Kimberly, you know, got some... I was like, is... Like, Kimberly, is, like, is she just gonna be, like, Green Arrow and Injustice, pretty much? Got some cool range attacks. You know, this isn't terrible. Like, I mean, I, I don't, that sounds a little more, like, dismissive. Like, it, it's actually, it's solid. It seems solid so far. You know, I've spent a lot more time with it so far. Like, I've played worse fighting games or, and games in general. Like, this scene, look at that. That was pretty cool. Huh. So that's, like, a little mind thing. A si Wait, you can have tags? There's tags? It's not just single? Okay. I'm getting smacked here. Eat your heart out. Eh. It's because my last name is Hart. You know, I just realized Kimberly Hart wears pink. She's the pink ranger and her last name is Hart. So is she, she's like the Hart family, the Hart wrestling family, like Bret Hart and Owen Hart and Stu Hart and all those guys. Like, is she a secretly a, a member of the Hart family? Because if so, Natalia, current WWE superstar Natalia, a member of the Hart family, should really consider adopting a Pink Ranger gimmick. Mainly because she's kind of been the same basic character since she debuted. Um, so she could really use something new. So I think she should look into Pink Ranger. Since the uh, the lineage is already there. Clearly. Okay. I want to know what's going on with these Black Ranger Stormtrooper guys. Oh, that's nice. Is there, I keep trying, I keep instinctively, because I, I play a lot of Mortal Kombat, I'm a huge Mortal Kombat fan, I instinctively keep trying to uppercut. Okay, I like, I think I like Kimberly the most so far, actually. I'm a sucker for, because I'm a fan of uh, bow users, like I love using Green Arrow and Injustice, and, um, oh. Tommy! Ah. Whoever you are, get away from him! <laughs> it's far too late. The crystal feeds on green chaos energy. Green chaos? His death is already underway. There's nothing you can do to stop it. Hey, Time Who Force Lady! No time! Start firing! Destroy that crystal and keep him from leaving! No! Not yet. I'm too close. Oh. Okay. Tommy! Tommy, it's gonna be okay. Please, please just stay with me. <laughs> It's okay, Kim. It's okay. Everything's gonna be okay. Tommy, wake up! You have to wake up! I like the He's the panels. Those no look cool. Help. Like the art. We need help! Don't die! You can't die! Please! Oh my God, Tommy! What's up with He's Zach's hair? Like shave it. He's gone. Oh! I was too late. I couldn't get back far enough. Who are you? My name is Jen Scotts. I'm from the future. I'm here because existence is in danger. And only Power Rangers can save it. No! Oh, oh, late title. Okay. Getting dramatic. They killed Tommy. I mean, I guess that's one way to kick off a story. You kill the best ranger ever. So Lord Draken is to all those who Tommy. Hear these words. Or, oh, Zordon. My name is Zordon of Eltar. I come to you from across the grid with a warning. I like this Zordon better than the stage Zordon. A great threat is upon us. His name is Lord Drac. Oh, okay. So he made those stormtrooper power rangers. With his newly charged chaos crystal, Lord Draken is able to move his forces across time and space. We have found a way to target rangers. Their black dragon cannons are designed to disrupt all connections to the north. However, his true desire is to steal Morphers. With them, he will See, attempt. I don't to know the. I don't know those Rangers, those samurai-looking guys. In this time of great uncertainty, they look cool, though. We must stand together and, if possible, come to each other's aid. Defend your worlds. Protect yourselves and your Morphers at all costs. And may the power protect you all. Okay. 
cool. But when do I play as Zack, the Black Ranger? That's that's the real question, you know. Yeah, we I want to know more about this Lord Draken guy. Mastodon Century, that's what they're called, huh? Who's Udana? Don't know you. I know not what you are, but these lands are under my protection. Um, tell me in the comments, what season is this um Udana from? Is this a more recent one? Is it from a few years ago? Let's see, magic. I mean, aren't all Power Rangers magic, technically? Like, I know it's technology, too, but it's kind of like, it's like, is, is Power Rangers more magic, or is it more tech? There's always seemed like a blend of the two, but I've always leaned a little bit more towards the magic side. Let's see. So I don't know what to expect from her. Um, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, she's Sub-Zero. I can, I can work with that. That's something I can familiarize myself with. Yeah, she's still, like slower. It's like she's more of a range user. Yeah, just yeah, whatever I'm doing right now, I'm just hitting button combinations, seeing what happens. Yeah, just do more of that. Uh oh, yeah. Okay. Ooh, I was gonna grab. There we go. See what the grabs are. I wonder if this background, I guess this is from the whatever show Udana comes from, like that dragon skull in the back. Like, if you know what that is, tell me what that's all about. Educate me on Udana the Ice Ranger with the really big shoulder things. Uh, she looks cool, like her design. Not today, Mastodon. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I thought something was gonna happen there. I thought I was expecting like a firing squad to show up. No. Yeah. I like that spinny thing. I want to nail you with that. I like staffs. Uh, Jade is one of my favorite characters in Mortal Kombat because of her staff. Okay, so I like her. Sub Zero Jade. So. Oh, there he is! And he looks kind of weird. And he kind of looks like an action figure. It, it, I don't know. I let me see if I can remember Goldar's voice. It was like, "Huh, Ranger." Uh, no, no, no. It was like more like, "Rangers have lost the Mystic Four. Uh, it, it sounded like someone doing a monster voice, but also if they are a chain smoker. From what I remember, the Mystic Four has fallen. I give you one chance, Udana. Surrender to me now. Turn over your staff, and my Lord may show you mercy, uh, or I'll put you in a really foggy room and stab the ground until I, I find you. Your master should check his wits, Goldar, if you think I would ever yield to the likes of you so they know each other. No yeah! That's the voice! That's the voice! Power of snow. Is it the, Again, is it the same voice actor? Did they just get everybody back for this? Goldar looks different. Does he, um... Oh, I'm Goldar! Okay. I was trying to play as a uh, Udana. So does Goldar come back in the later seasons? Because he looks... Because, like, Goldar, I remember, was, like, all entirely shiny gold. But this Goldar has like, got, like, some black to him. So, again, is this just for the game, or does he come back later in uh, one of the new seasons? I love that he has the same stupid voice. That's great. You are finished. Oh, man, I'm... She's... Effing me up. Hey! Okay. Yeah! Okay, it's stabby there. Uh, oh no. Come on, Goldar. Come on, Goldar. Yeah, do. I don't know how I did that, but do it again. Oh, oh, okay. I guess we're done. When I return more powerful than before, it will be to claim your. Wow. This game's dark. At least darker than the average Power Rangers episode. She would not stray from the forest in the meantime. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna finish up Act 1. And then maybe we'll check out online. We'll see how long this takes. Maybe I'll jump into online earlier. Let's see what's coming up. I just really want to be the Black Ranger. I mean I could probably just pick the pack the Black Ranger online. 
Gia Moran. I recognize that ranger, but I've not seen the show. But I, I, I've seen that ranger in the commercials and at like as an action figure in like toy stores. Um, remember toy stores? Gia Moran. She's like a pirate. Like pirate we'll season, never give up without a fight. which if pirate season happened when I watched Power Rangers, I would be all on board for that because I love pirate things. Um, so I'm disappointed we did not, I did not get pirate rangers during my time. Okay. Let's see. So what's so special about Gia Moran? Why is she the first pirate ranger to to kind of get a showcase here? Oh wait. I see coins up there. Do we get to use the Zords? I see Z Like, we got the original Megazord and Goldar. What does that mean? Are they gonna show up? Oh, what is- Oh, she's got like a whip? Or does her sword become a whip? I think her- Oh, her sword is like a whip, too. Alright. Oh, I like her. She's- She's- I like that. Again, I like- I like whippy things. In, in fighting games, not in general, but uh, <laughs> just <laughs> should probably clarify. It. Wait, how did you? Wait, what? How did? Wait, what? What's happening? Who did that? Did he do that, or does that just happen because of the stage? I okay. I don't know what's going on there. All right, let's beat up fake Black Ranger. Ah, oh, damn it! Come on. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Don't like this. Still gotta beat his buddy, too. Oh, come on. You should have just taken that. Oh no. Gia. Alright. You know what? Um, let's try to go online real quick. Let's let's do that. We can always come back to this if I feel like it. Um Okay, so we're going to go online here. Um, apparently there's some sort of episode going on, some sort of online event. Um, casual would be nice. Oh, crossplay. Okay, that's nice. Okay, so is this the full roster or is your deal? Oh no, there's. I don't know if this is DLC or you unlock them. Actually, that the Red Ranger Time Force. Actually, no, that's not the Red Ranger. That's the Quantum Ranger. Right. Because the Red Ranger of Time Force looks very similar to Quantum Ranger. Or is that him? I don't remember. But anyways, the only Power Ranger I've ever met in real life was the, the Time Force Red Ranger at like a small nerd convention in Fort Lauderdale years ago. Like me and my friend took a picture with him. And it was hilarious because the friend I was with was also super into Power Rangers. And like basically freaked out, like got like starstruck and did, was afraid to talk to him. Because he's like, oh my god, it's a Power Ranger. And he's like, I've never met a Power Ranger. And so, like, me and another buddy, we were talking to the to the Red Ranger guy. He was there. Actually, he made a he made a, an amazing entrance because we found his booth, but his booth he wasn't at his booth. But we're like, oh my god, there's a Power Ranger here, but he's not here right now. And my friend who was nervous is like, oh my god, I would do anything to meet a Power Ranger. And then, like, perfectly on cue, the actor walks out of nowhere and goes, I guess today's your lucky day, or something like that. And we're like, oh. And then he's, and he was like really nice for talking to him. You know, he's asking us about our day and where we're from and stuff. And the whole time, my friend just could not say anything. He's like, I don't know what to say because we're talking to a Power Ranger. Oh, I remember him from, yeah, Lost Galaxy. He was a weird one because like that was the season that didn't have the traditional six Ranger. It was just this guy. And he wasn't really a Power Ranger. He was just kind of like a, another dude. He was like what, what Tuxedo Mask is to Sailor Moon. To the rest of the Sailor Moon girls. Um, Ranger Slayer. That's cool as hell looking. See, that's the Goldar I know. That's classic Goldar. Oh, I remember the Gold Ranger. Didn't that wind up being Jason from the original season when they unmasked him? Dashi. Don't know him. Lord Zed. Hell yeah. Still one of the coolest looking villains ever. In a way, I'm kind of always surprised that they got away with him, like, for kid TV. Like, he's basically, like, a, a skinless man with his brain exposed. Like, that's kind of terrifying looking. Cinezoic. Oh, that's from the movie. Okay. I've never seen the movie, actually. I've been meaning to watch the movie because I've heard it's better than you, than people thought. Dragon Armor Trini. Oh, oh rest in peace, Trini. 
Um, you know what? Let's be Lord Dracula, because we don't have a the regular Black Ranger, we got the fake one. So let's try a Draken out. Oh, color? Oh, Evo. Oh, Evo. Um, yeah. Oh, I get a partner. Okay. Um. Let's do, uh. Uh, who should I try? Let's try, uh, Dragon's Ranger, or Ranger Slayer. That's pretty cool. Oh, oh. Colors. Let's stick with classic. Will I get a third? Oh, okay. This is just Marvel vs. Capcom. Alright, um... Let's get Magna Defender in there. Why not? Initiate Megazord sequence. Oh, we gotta do Dragon Zord. Yeah. Yeah. And now we wait. Okay. So we've been matched up. Um... This is probably going to be a uh, disaster for me, but like I said, I want to see what a like what high level play is, or at least people that in general, at least the very basic, know what they're doing. Okay, so he, whoever this person is, is um okay, I'm not bad. Like the I just have to use my general kind of fighting game instincts since I don't know the the, the uh, everyone's moves or the nuances. Well, you know, fighting games, like, just the general psychology and logic behind it always, you know, is transferable. And that's honestly how I get by playing fighting games, like, new fighting games for the first time against people that know them. It's just, you know, reapplying the same principles, which honestly can get you by pretty far when you're still trying to learn the actual combos and stuff like that. Like, knowing when to block, knowing how to lure people in, knowing when to hang back, that kind of stuff. I don't know how to change characters, I just realized that. It's probably the shoulder buttons, if it's like, like, Dragon Ball Fighters or something. Okay, that's assist. I'm doing better than I thought, and I probably shouldn't be getting cocky. We still have a lot of fight to go, but, um, I'm not getting destroyed, but I'm also not playing ranked. Well, I guess if I was, I would just be ranked with someone that also is a moody. Okay, I don't like that move. That's annoying. Oh, no! Wow, it kicks you back to the main menu, not even to the online lobby. What happened? Okay, well, I was doing so well that the the game couldn't handle it. And, uh, kicked me back. Oh, well, that's, that's disappointing. Um, yeah, uh, let's see. Guess we'll try again. Okay, we're back. Um, so I've matched up with another person. Um, I picked the same squad that I had last time. So we didn't. We barely scratched the surface of this potential of this team. Uh, I got a new person, Super Black Bunner, whatever your name is. Um, you know, you're on camera. So let's see. Man, I'm upset. I was doing super good against that uh, last opponent. So um, hopefully that carries over to whoever this is. Oh, funny, they're also starting with the Raid Ranger, right? Let's go. Alright, you seem like you might know what you're doing. Um, Alright, kick. Oh, I like that kick. Kind of like cancels. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, the sparks come out of them. Oh, I love that. That was always the weird thing to me about Power Rangers. It's like, I was, I used to always wonder as a kid, like, how come when they get hit, sparks fly out of their suits? So, like, are their suits made of, like, electric? Like, are they mechanical? Is that, like, is there a bunch of, like, wiring in their suits? Because they just look like nylon you know, spandex or something. And I that I would seriously ponder that question all the time. Like, I really was trying to rationalize it. Oh my... What? What is going on? Is it... Is it me? My internet's fine. As far as I can tell. And I rarely ever get kicked out of anything, any game when I play online. Like, it's very rare. So I don't know what's going on here. Maybe it's it could be the people, it could be the game servers. I mean, maybe it is me, but uh yeah, um we'll try one more, one more match. Okay, so here we are again. Third time, final time. We're going to see how long this sticks. I don't know what's happening here with the uh getting kicked out of these matches, but we'll try one more. Bow before your lord. I would love to, but I might get kicked out the match before I can bow to anyone. Alright, here we go. Maybe if I beat these guys as quickly as possible. You know what it is? 
it's probably not the game. It's because I was playing so good that my last two opponents gave up. Like, they knew I was going to win. So they were like, I'm not going to stand for this. I don't want to get beat by this expert. So I'm going to quit out. That that Honestly, that makes more sense. These damn cowards just don't want to just don't want to hang with me so i think the key is to play worse like i don't want to whoop them too good like i should probably give this person some space because if i'm too dominant they might give up on me so yeah that's my story and i'm sticking to it okay i still don't know how to change characters like that at all i know how to summon them to like help me but i don't know how to actually switch and i need to switch because magna defenders messing me up right now I'm not liking it. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Let me get out of here. I mean, it, it, all right. Wait, what the? What happened? I thought you were leaving. Oh, okay, that was this. Oh, man. Uh, Lord Dragon's about to eat it here. How do you change characters? <laughs> I I don't know how to. I'm hitting every combination that it would normally change characters in other games. Um, all right. Let's do the cool looking Pink Ranger. She really does look pretty awesome. I would like to know more about this version of the Pink Ranger. So apparently it's Kimberly, so they must have brought her back, like, later on. Like the actress Amy Jo Johnson, whatever her name is. The only other thing I've ever seen the Kimberly actress in besides Power Rangers was that Suzy Q movie. A really obscure movie that used to come on Disney Channel all the time in the 90s. Um, if you know CCQ, let me know in the comments, because I never met another person that knew that movie. <laughs> uh, okay. Let me, okay, Magna Defender Gods. Like, let me at least get rid of Magna Defender. Oh, you've got Ice Lady. Don't like that. Oh, I switched. How did I switch? Okay. I hit the shoulder button. Maybe if you hold it, maybe that's a, I guess that would make sense. That's like a fighter's Dragon Ball. Okay, you're pretty slow, but Kimberly needs to heal up, so I'm gonna... S yeah, you're a... You're a slow... Magna Defender kind of looks like a big Beetleborg, now that I think about it. Which, uh, I also was a big fan of Big Bad Beetleborgs, which was pretty much a Power Rangers ripoff that was around at the same time. But I was also entertained by it. Okay, that seems to be doing alright, that Sword Strike. Uh, Magna Defender's really... All right, let's go back to you because you're faster. All right, yeah, I like, I like what you got to offer. Uh oh, there we go. Jeez, okay. How do I? I need to, I need to find a reliable. Okay, I was like, I need a reliable arrow shot to keep her since we're two range characters. Kind of keep her at bay there. Okay, nice. Nice. Okay. Um, the game hasn't crashed yet. That's that's good. That's the that's the real victory here. Is the game has not lost the connection. All right. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Wait. Oh, there's a time limit. Oh, I win! Hey! I didn't even know there was a clock. Oh, I lost? Wait, how come I was standing triumphantly? What? Why was... What? How did I... I, I why was I not on the ground on my knees? Okay. Well, I did it, I guess. I mean, I lost. But, I mean, like I said, the real victory is that I actually finished a match, so. There you go. So, you know what? How about we go back to the story. Let's finish off Act 1. Let's just see where this goes. And then we'll call it a day. How about that? Dun -dun -dun -dun. G -g -g -a. Oh, yeah, that's right. I got a pirate chick. One, fight. Okay. So this seems pretty cool so far, this game. This is alright. Like I said, it's not gonna make me want to put down, like, Mortal Kombat or Dragon Ball Fighters, but, like, this is, uh, way better than I expected. I thought, honestly, I was like, this looks like, I want to say trash, but just, like, I don't think this is gonna be very good. Um, but then when I started hearing that people were uh, super into this game, I, even then I was like, okay, but, you know, there's Power Rangers is a really, you know, long and, and, and dedicated, you know, fan base, so, like, of course they would like it. Um, and I say this as someone that used to be really into Power Rangers, but that was as a kid, you know. But, no, they, whoever, I don't know who developed this, I forget. Um, 
don't like you. I'm gonna shoot my gun. But uh, solid job. I I would like. I hope the roster is bigger than what it is. Like I don't know if there's other, if there's more unlockables outside of those Time Force characters, like or if they're all DLC. But I mean, with so many Rangers to choose from, I would hope that the roster should really, even if they're all DLC, I feel like the base roster should be bigger than what it is, just because of the sheer amount of Power Rangers. Like I feel like there should be more offered up front instead of um if. If, if there's more DLC characters than there are just in the game, then that's a bit of a problem to me. Even though, I mean, there's probably mainstream games that have gotten to that point. Like, how many DLC characters are in Mortal Kombat, like, 11 now compared to who came in the box? So, alright, he did it! Good job, pirate chick! Oh, there she is! Ranger Slayer! I was gonna say, like, Ranger Slayer is probably a bad guy. That doesn't sound like a someone that would help you out. I'm pretty sure the name says it. Yeah, I mean, that's true. That was kind of a dumb question, Gia. I will do all that is necessary. We'll never give up without a fight. Three. Never. One. Fight. All right, let's see. Ranger Slayer. I want to summon a Megazord. That's what I want to do. I don't know how you make that happen. Okay. I don't remember seeing... Maybe I missed her, but I don't even remember... Oh, wait! I'm the Ranger Slayer! I just realized that. I've been... This whole time, I've been thinking I was G. I was wondering why my... My button presses weren't doing what I wanted them to do. Even though I don't really know what I'm doing anyway. Um, okay, that makes more sense. Man, they don't make that super clear. Like, not in the way that Mortal Kombat makes it clear when you're playing the story mode and they switch fighters. Um... It's a little too seamless. Okay. I don't... See, I think she did that. Like, when it says Mega, I guess that means you can summon it. I just don't know how. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I like Ranger Slayer. I mean, like, she's pretty much the same as Kimberly, it seems, in terms of her moveset, but... She's like the cooler Kimberly, so why would I ever pick regular Kimberly when, Dra when uh, Ranger Slayer is right there with the same moves, but a way cooler look? Like, she's pretty much like Dark Pit and Smash Brothers. Like, I like Pit, but Dark Pit is slightly cooler, so I may as well just pick Dark Pit. Ah. So what's your favorite Power Rangers season, guys? Let me know in the comments. Who is a... For anyone that was a fan of Power Rangers, what was the best season? Space, Galaxy, Wild Force, Ninja... Force, Samurai, Gun, I'm just making them up. I know there's, like, other pirate season. I know there's been, like, another dinosaur kind of thing. I, where, does, where does Ranger Slayer come from? Is that your favorite season? Let me know. I want to know. Let's see. Lord Draken has a special place for people like her. All right. Take her to the moon prison. Who the hell? Catmance. Manx? Sorry, but that's not going to happen. Ram. I assume that's how this person talks. I've got strict orders to rescue some rangers. I will absolutely go through you to do it. Is this a Power Ranger or is this like a like a Power Ranger adjacent? SPD, Cat Ranger. I think I've heard of SPD. It's like the cop themed Power Rangers, right? Because it's like she doesn't really have like uh she's not just the Red Ranger or what a cat. That's weird. It's just a Cat Ranger. Even though she kind of, her ears kind of look more like a bat, honestly, than a kitten or a kitty. All right, let's see what she's got. Is she does she play like Catwoman in Injustice? Kind of vaguely reminds me of Catwoman, actually. All right, it's kind of similar stance and stuff. There is definitely there's some Catwoman parallels here. All right, let's see. I'm learning so much about modern Power Rangers from just this game, and I'm confused about most of it, but I, I, you know, I know it exists, which I guess is the real, the real accomplishment. Like, I would have never known about Cat Manx before this game, and I'm sure she's a very important character, because they put her in here. So, uh, tell, if you know anything about Cat Manx, uh, let me know. I know I'm asking a lot of you guys to tell me, pretty much teach me everything about Power Rangers. But yeah, if Cat Manx is your favorite Power Ranger, tell me why. What is what is cool about her? Outside of the fact that I'm kicking these guys' ass with her. Yeah, cat makes. Mm. 
Okay. Well, you're about to die. I should just rush in and just kill you. Come on, man. Yeah! Hey there, can you hear me? An SPD? Oh, you guys, you know what that is, huh? I, okay, she agrees. Like, oh, that's, I'm surprised you know that. She really does look more like a bat. Like, am I, am, am I the only one that thinks it's more batty? An orange ranger? Wait, she's an orange ranger? I, I wasn't even sure if she was a ranger, but I, I just realized she was orange. Is she the... Oh, I've, I've never seen an orange Power Ranger. Okay. Oh, I'm Lord Draken now, so he's gonna win this. Which I guess makes sense. I, I don't know if Cat Manx is... Um, she seems cool, but I don't think she's the... I don't think she's meant to be the one to take down Lord Draken. So, let's make this quick. Let's put her out of her, her, mit her misery. I like Lord Draken's design. I mean, you know, it is just a fusion of the red ranger or the red ranger the white ranger and the green ranger but it's a cool looking fusion yeah yeah so how come i used to wonder this too as a kid you know the green ranger has a shield he wears a shield and so did the white ranger why don't all the power rangers just have shields like why can't they all just have one cuz that's just you know that's just more protection I don't see any drawback to having one. So why can't Zordon be like, hey, you guys should all just have these? So I remember there was an episode where the Red Ranger got the Green Ranger shield. Like he was like it was just a Red Ranger with the Green Ranger shield. I don't remember how he got it. And she is not letting me out of here. Oh wow, what is she? Dude, let me out. Jeez. <laughs> um like the Red Ranger got to wear the the Green Ranger shield. I just don't remember how he did it. But I was like, I remember thinking back then, like, how come they don't all just get one? Like, just make some for everybody. I would I would love to know, like, has that been addressed in, like, the comics or anything? Like, what is so special about the shield that it can't be shared? Or mass-produced, really. Okay, I gotta... Try to do, like, his M. Bison stomp thing. Okay. I'm trying to finish you off, Jay. There we go, there we go. Oh, oh, ho! Oh, special finish. Dead. Done. Come in, SPD. I need to get. Oh. Oh! Anubis Kruger. What are these names for these SPD characters? I mean, they're kind of cool, but. So, Anubis, so he's a dog, obviously, because Anubis, and she's Cat Minx. Okay, she got out of there. It appears I have a visitor. Take the yellow one away. No more delays. Okay, this is taking longer than I wanted to. We're coming up on time here. So we'll go as far as we can. Oh, there he is. Magna Defender. I had an action figure of the Magna Defender as a kid. The coolest thing I ever owned for, like, Power Rangers things, and uh, honestly, this is probably the coolest toy I ever owned in general, was I used to have the Megazord that was from the first Power Rangers movie, like, the one that was the animals, with, like, the bear and the frog and the, the white ranger had the eagle. Like, I had the full Megazord of that, that you, you, they were all the separate pieces, and you put them together, and I remember that no being my pride and joy as a kid. Because I used to have, you know, like, outside of that, I had, like, a few Ranger action figures. Like, I had the, I used to have the, the flip heads, like, the, the classic Power Rangers where you flip their heads and it would go from their, like, regular face to their helmet, their helmeted face. Like, I had, I had three of those. I had one for, uh, the Black Ranger, the Blue Ranger, and the Red Ranger, so I guess all the guys. Um, and I used to play with those a lot, but then I got the, the movie Megazord. And that was my way of, like having something cool because like before that I remember there was a kid in my neighborhood and this is around like fourth grade probably and he was the kid like I feel like we all have this kid where like that friend where he's the friend that has everything that nobody else has like he's like the quote-unquote rich kid he may or not be actually rich but he just has like all the cool toys that you want and don't have he was that kid like he would me and my friends we were playing in his garage 
because this garage was filled with all of this stuff, like all of these toys. And he had the Power Ranger weapons, like he, like the weapons that they use, like like the axe gun that the Black Ranger used and the, the sword that the Red Ranger used. Like he had all of them for everybody. And I remember wanting those as a kid and I never had any of them. So we like, you know, we play Power Rangers, but he's even better because now we can pretend to be Power Rangers with the actual weapons. And he also had the morphers no with it. And we were like, dude. And he was like a nice kid. He's like, yeah, let's all play with these and stuff. Um, and I was like, yeah, all right. So, oh wait, I'm playing as this. I mean, I guess I get to be the Black Ranger. I'm, I'm the Black Ranger thing. Um, which is all right, but it's not, it's not my Black Ranger. Hashtag not my Black Ranger. But um, but yeah, I remember that was one of the, the most uh, entertaining like I guess play sessions, whatever you want to call it, play outside things, um, from my childhood. Cause we all picked the ranger we wanted. Of course, I called the Black Ranger, so I got the cool axe gun, and we just ran around the park pretending to be Power Rangers. And it was all thanks to the rich kid that had everything that we wanted. <laughs> uh, let's see. Right. What are we over? Oh, Sounds like we're countering each other. You're dead. Oh, you're not dead. You got one more life bar. Come on, Magna Defender. Uh, this guy kind of sucks. If this was Zack, he'd be better. This guy is. He's not great. He's like, he's like, he's alright. He's passable, but. I mean. I'm also fighting the Magna Defender. I should probably... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can just switch to one of my other clones of me. That's so weird. Like, not a lot of fighting games I can think of let you play as, like, the grunts. And he is, uh... He is not going down without a fight, Magna Defender. But I guess these guys are actual characters on the roster, too, because they, they were on the select screen for the online, which is disappointing, because it was like, so we went with these guys as the Black Ranger representative instead of the actual Black Ranger? Like, are these guys, like, are they all different people on the mass? Or is it clones of Zack? Like, is it, like, Star Wars? Are they, like, clone troopers, basically? Like, it's just a bunch of Zacks? All right. Final act. I wonder, I wonder what's gonna happen. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, now we got movie rangers. I I will watch that movie one day. Um. Wow, is that how he talks in the movie? Because isn't no idea the power I possess. Because I haven't seen the movie, obviously, but um. I always thought they were movie versions of the classic cast, like it was still like Jason, Billy, Kimberly, Trini, just movie versions. So is this, is this still just Billy? Just a different version of Billy? Because he sounded really smart. Um, or is it just, or, or did the movie just make up its own characters entirely? I also don't know if I like how they look. Like I still, years later, I remember looking at them and being like, I don't know what I think of those designs. Like, I don't hate them, which is, I guess, a good sign. Like, I didn't immediately be like, this looks like crap. Um, but I also didn't fall in love with them either. I'm kind of in a weird middle ground with them of like, maybe I can just take or leave them. Also, why the blue? Why the blue ranger for the movies? I mean, I guess you can't all pick, you can't pick the leaders from every season because then you have a bunch of red and green rangers, but I don't know. Okay. Mega. God damn it. Okay. God damn it. Get him. Mess him up. Stop blocking. Okay. I will say at least they're keeping the story mode relatively fresh, but they they, they switch characters uh real real often. Um, even quicker than like Nether Realm. Like usually Nether Realm, um, you know, a character gets like an entire chapter to itself. Which is fine, I love those story modes and like Mortal Kombat and Injustice. But I'm noticing um, here, they give you a new character almost like every fight. And what the hell was all that? It was really cool. I don't know how I did it. But who cares? Because I won. Uh oh. 
good news, there's more sentries coming for you. The bad news is that I'm here instead. Again, this world has no developed life forms, capable of intelligent. Where does he live? Is he living like on another planet? Like primordial Earth? Of course, my lord. I will do all that is necessary. You have no idea the power I possess. Three, two, one, fight. Oh, I'm dragon or I keep wanting to call her Dragon Slayer, Ranger Slayer. So Um maybe Billy is uh not gonna not gonna walk away from this fight unscathed. Ooh. Hmm. Alright. Ah. Alright. There we go. See, if I was a kid, because you know when you're a kid and you're picking Power Rangers, like you're playing with your friends and you do the thing where like, alright, which Power Ranger are you? And you try to yell to Power Rangers that you want to be as quickly as possible before somebody else takes it, like, because then that's how the, that's how friendships are ended, when two people yell Red Ranger at the same time, and you get the standoff of, like, dude, I'm the Red Ranger, like, no, I said it first, you be this, you be the Blue Ranger, like, I don't want to be the Blue Ranger, he's the loser, um, and then, you know, there's only five Rangers, and if you're playing with only boys, and there's more than three of you, somebody has to be the girls, and as a little kid, as a little boy, you don't want to be that guy. Nobody wants to be the girl rangers, no matter how cool they are. Because that's just, you know, they're just immature boys. But, it, you know, I gotta admit, I think even me as a kid would be totally down with Dragon Slayer. I'd be like, well, she's like a murderer, basically. Uh-oh. Oh, wow, she figured it out. She knows. I'd tell you to run back to Zordon, but you wouldn't. All right. Some pink. Oh, Red Ranger's here too, just posing. Got some pink on pink violence here. But yeah, like, yeah, Ranger Slayers might be the coolest character I've seen. Maybe even cooler than Lord Draken. So I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll take the bullet for the, for the, for the group. I'll be the, I'll be, I'll be the pink ranger, but only if I can be Ranger Slayer, pink ranger. And they all stare at me, be like, what is Ranger Slayer? And, uh, you know, because it turns out I actually tra time traveled from the future to set up this play date. And, alright. Okay. Those things come down slower than I thought. Like, the time out. I know I have Tom, uh, Jason with me, but I'm not gonna switch to him. He can assist. This is a, this needs to be, you know, this has to be Pink Ranger on Pink Ranger. It's just, this is personal. Ooh, that was a hell of a kick. Ha I weren't looking at that bomb that I left strategically. What the, what just happened? Oh, okay, jeez, that's so jarring. I keep, <laughs> I've already had the game crash on me or online. I thought something bad happened. It's nothing. Then maybe we should go another round. I promise. I'll make a stronger impression. You have nerve, Ranger. But when our eminence is finished with you, it'll be a distant memory. We already have what he requires. Secure the prisoner. We return home. Now. You okay? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I just fought myself? We have a situation. The domed city of Corinth. Home of the I RPA remember Rangers. her. The Rangers leader, Wasn't Dr. she K. one of the alien Rangers? The dragon cannons. What? Jen, Wasn't she Australian? If we could stop their cannons, the sentries wouldn't be able to warp our powers. This is huge. Yes, but the city's under siege. Maybe I'm mistaken. The Space Patrol Delta Rangers and the RPM Rangers are doing their best to hold off Draken's forces, but there's a 10 mile no teleportation zone. We can't get Dr. K or her tech out. Dr. And ever K. since Zordon sent out his message, I've been getting energy pings from rangers in other eras, survivors of Draken's attacks. Jason, I know Corinth is important, but if there are ranger survivors out there... Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Lauren and I will head to Corinth and work on getting Dr. K to safety. Jen, you and Kim pick up whatever rangers you can. Make sure you take Trini. She's been working on some new armor upgrades that may come in handy. Was Trini Everyone always stay the... stay in touch, and we'll rendezvous the back at the command center. armor... Got it. Forger? I don't remember that about her character. I don't remember much about Trini's character in general, like the original Yellow Ranger. Like, she was the one that had the 
the least identifiable like character from what I remember because you know Jason's the leader Kimberly's the hot chick kind of mall rat uh, Zach's the cool guy Billy's the nerd uh, Tommy's God and then uh, Trini was like the yellow ranger but apparently she's also war machine now too so uh, yeah that's a good look at Power Rangers Battle for the Grid um, like I said, pleasant surprise. I'd heard this game was better than you might think. I agree. It's it's pretty solid. It was actually pretty fun. Um, online things aside, but again, maybe that was me on my end. I, I don't know. I, I doubt it, but, you know, who knows. But, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. If you're a Power Rangers fan, absolutely try it. Um, it's on PlayStation, Xbox, PC. It's also on Xbox Game Pass. Uh, so, there you go. I don't know if it's on Switch or not. Perhaps. Maybe. Um, but, yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So, if you enjoyed this video, uh, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And if you want to hit me up on Twitter and tell me all of your Power Rangers knowledge, if you want to dump that on me and just get me caught up, um, you can find me on Twitter at MarcusStewart7. That is the number seven. You can also find me on Twitch at MarcusStreamsGames. I stream uh, Tuesday and Thursday nights. And you can also find me on my personal website, MarcusWritesAboutGames.wordpress.com. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll be back tomorrow with 30 Days of Backlog, Day 13. I will see you then. Hey, if you're a Sailor Moon fan or love anime in general, be sure to check out a podcast by Moonlight. It's the podcast where I and co-host Jack Gardner watch every episode of Sailor Moon for the first time ever. We give a play-by-play -play breakdown of each episode, discuss and debate theories for where the show is headed, and... Most importantly, make a bunch of stupid jokes and idiotic observations for your listening pleasure. Every Wednesday, you can listen to a podcast by Moonlight on Spotify and Libsyn, as well as follow the official Twitter account at APB Moonlight to keep up with new content. Moon, Prism, Power, Makeup, and Subscribe.